happy Saturday, folks. Um, just wanted to give you a, an update on what's going on. Uh, so, last week I was able to get some some work done. You can see I have some of the hydroton inside the grow bed now, and I actually had to go get another pack because I was about 80 liters short. This is a 50 liter hydroton bag or grow media. Um, so I was short a little bit because I had a, one bag, so I need to get about 30 liters out of this bag or so. But that's not um, really the, the main issue. Right now, my most pressing issue is my drain. So I had a U siphon in here. And from my previous setup, I had U siphons uh, set up to work inside of here. Well, but I had four separate little grow pans. So just for a quick example, let me step around through here. Moo doggy. These were my older grow pans. They're just, just bus pans. And I had the U siphon, but I had the kind that had the 45 degree angle down below and then um, it takes two 90 degree angles and then you can see the other 45 degree angle. And this this works worked pretty good, but this time on the larger tank, I tried to keep it a little bit simple and, and, and try to go with just really a plain U siphon. And if you remember, let me put this back. So it just looks like this, but remember in some of the previous videos, I actually did a fill and it drained absolutely fine. Um, problem is I did it with a water hose that had a little bit more flow and two, it was completely empty. So the water actually got a chance to get above, oh, let me put this back so I can show you. So the water actually had a chance to rise above here to be able to create the siphon and pull the water out. Um, so one of the things that I was running into was whenever I got ready to start the siphon, it would start and then it would drain to about here. And then for some reason it was breaking the siphon and the water would only stop here. So the way that I had to get around that was put my hand down below on the drain pipe, let the water fill to probably like you know a few inches higher or not probably about a quarter inch higher than what this is and then it finally created a proper um, siphon so what I'm going to do today to try to get around that is go with the bell siphon and I've never used a bell siphon but I know the concept so I went and got some parts today so essentially this will be my stand pipe I actually need to cut a little bit more and then I'll have a two inch I mean a two inch pipe that'll go around here and then I'll put a three inch pipe around that and then I'll give you an update on that so hopefully now I can get my water level a little bit lower than what I had here and then also I can create a consistent and um, always working siphon so anyway that's my update for today need to cut some PVC pipe need to do a little bit of um, testing and maneuvering, but I um, also need to clean some more hydroton to put inside of here. But anyway, that's the update for today. And um, hope you guys have a great rest of the day. Later.